Hello everybody, this is the Pickaxe of Diamonds, and today I've prepared a little Christmas special for you all. Now, I've just set up this Christmas tree that says, Merry Christmas above it. You can see it's got glowstone for lights, and a whole bunch of different wool for ornaments, and to top it, a whole bunch of gold blocks. Pretty good, huh? Well, do you think I can top it? Okay. Well, let's go over here, where I've got an even bigger Christmas tree. <laughs> it's got a whole bunch of ornaments all the way around it, glowstone at the top for the lights, and guess what? There's a lever down here where the lights, they're even toggleable. You can light up all of the lights, most of them from inside the tree where there's a lot of redstone as you can see and some of them there was just it was just too close together lights up this far so I had to bring it outside the tree but anyhow let's go and sh show you the redstone inside let's first start at the bottom so when you pull this lever it sends a current to these blocks right here and then you can s consider these the branches of the Christmas tree because, you know, they're made of wood. They're, they're branches. And uh, all this redstone goes to every individual redstone lamp. And for the ones on the corners like this, or right next to the corners, I had to do something. I had to do something with the redstone where you put a redstone repeater there. And it's actually right there. Uh, I'll show you actually. There's a piece of redstone right here. You can't see it because, well, that actually got rid of the block. But there's a piece of redstone right here and that activates this. And this activates this. Bam, you've got yourself Christmas lights. So anyway, now let's go up and show you some of the other things I've done. Uh, hmm. Oh yes, there's this, where I actually had to put green wool block here, because it won't really work. You see, this redstone even isn't touching the lamp at all. It just carries through this block. That's a special function of repeaters. And this repeater was meant to prevent this redstone from... I'll just show you. From being connected to here. You see, it doesn't work. It has to be directly feeding into the piston or not the piston, the redstone lamp. And further up it's just more of that repeated. At some point I had to use some actual repeaters to make the current go higher. And uh, how do you get up there again? Yeah, this is, this is like a maze of redstone to me. But anyway, here there are some more of these corner redstone lamps and with the piston making the current go over here, igniting the redstone right there, some more of this, some more of that, the redstone in the corner, and there you go. Now let's head outside to this part, where the redstone actually has to go out of the tree because you can't do anything complex with repeaters in a 4x4 four four space. I tried. Unless, of course, I used, like, command blocks with set block commands, but uh, this was way easier to just wire the redstone outside of the tree. And so, basically, once it goes outside of the tree, it goes all the way around the lights. And it actually branches up to the highest level here of lights. And then there's the glowstone. So, as I said before, this is fully toggleable. You can turn it all the way off, and as you can see, all of the lights around the tree are all the way off. And with just one switch of a single lever, you can turn all the lights on. Now, there's one more thing I wanted to do before we finish off this episode.
is teleport me back to the original spot, which I think was uh, negative 4, negative, or 103, negative 114. Coordinates down. Yep, and there we go. So, the last thing I wanted to do is drop these cookies. Oops, that one landed right there. Drop these cookies on the table, and this milk, and we'll leave it there for Santa. Hmm. If there was a Minecraft Santa, I would totally put out milk and cookies for him, and he would probably like bring around a whole bunch of diamonds to all the Minecraft guys, all the guys in this Minecraft land. Well, anyway, hope you've enjoyed this Christmas special, thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.